Well guys, I'm having battery issues with this blazer. It's been sitting here about a month. And in that period of time, the battery went dead again. So that's a good battery. But they have a drain on it somewhere. So it went dead, dead, dead. And had it on the charger. So we know and see if it'll start just from me charging it for a while. If not, we'll click it on the engine start thing and see if that'll do it. So enjoy.
Eh, not that battery charged up, son. Oh, what's wrong with me leaving something sit that long? I got too many cars. Now it gets to a point you just can't keep up with everything. There you go, I'll give you glass pipe lovers your fix for the day. But those are going away pretty soon. Show you how. Looks better with that paint on it, doesn't it? I gotta get a bumper for it. The bumper is on as a chrome, and I need a black one. Black is supposed to be up on it. Show you what's gonna go on there as far as muffers. Yeah, a lot on there. That sure help me. Yeah, these are gonna go on. Got a set of these uh big old SUV. I don't know what those are, 70 series? Something like that, 50 series, 70 series, SUV Flowmasters, and that's what I'm going to put on it. Just not a glass pack kind of guy. You want to see something incredible while we're out here? <laughs> God, this thing's dirty. Uh, I like trees, but man, I tell you what, they'll screw up a car pretty quick. Park under one. All the crap that this truck's been through. It's having to work its way up here. <laughs> the air conditioner works. She's noisy. Compressor don't sound good. But it sure blows good. Let's see. Have to remember how to work this thing. There's a trick to it. You want it to stop in the middle. You got these little. Uh, It's got these little uh, thing hieroglyphics for the upper and lower, and if you want to stop in the middle, you get like that, you got to kind of push this thing in the middle on its way down or its way in and stop. But that feels good. I'm loving it. Like McDonald's. Okay. There's that arsehole of a dog over there. You know, like I said, I'm not, I'm not for abusing animals. But like my granddad on one side would say, that dog needs a good kick in the pants. It needs to be flying off the end of somebody's foot at least one time and that'd shut it up.
Hogs are, you know, they're, they're stupid. I mean, what do they want? They come out every hour on the hour and do the same thing over and over again like something's going to change. You stupid little fool. What's going to change? You're powerless. You're a dog. You're one foot off the ground. You can't take your stupid itself back inside. That's what I say to you. I think, guys, I'm going to put the Mercedes up for sale pretty soon. I, you know, invested some money in buying it out of pocket. So I just kind of wanted no real reason other than I, I just want to co concentrate on Mopar stuff. And when you only got so much money to do with, you just got to sometimes uh, liquidate. So it's running good and it's been a good car. I haven't had any problems out of it at all since I've had it. The only things of any consequence that's happened is the uh, sway bar end links on the rear end have uh, broken off on each side. But it's just been completely reliable. So I'm gonna put it up for sale, I guess, and see if somebody will buy it. And we might do the Mercedes thing again someday. Or if nobody buys it, I'll hang on to it, you know. But I just got too many things else, as always, that I want to do. Um, I still got the I still got the '63 Oldsmobile, and you know, this year is the uh, in November is the 50th anniversary of the assassination of President Kennedy. Uh, November, what was it, 22nd, 1963? And I'm kind of thinking in the back of my mind that I would like to. Um, that car's in storage down here outside of town. It's in a storage unit. I'm kind of thinking that if I I'm, maybe I try a little bit more to get that engine running, but not much. And what I'm thinking about doing is after I shoot that dog and bury it in a shallow grave back here, I'm thinking about um, fence over here, you jackass. But what I'm thinking about doing, guys, is uh, looking around for a good running V8 engine and transmission and get it in there and get that thing running. Because, you know, you can't have fun with a car where they're just sitting parked in storage or parked down in your yard not running. That's not the reason I bought it. So, I'm tossing that idea around. So anyway, that may happen this year, and then again, it may not. You never know why I am. I'm kind of unpredictable sometimes. You know, I don't care for unpredictable people, but I find myself being unpredictable too much. But anyway, let me make sure I get this in the right gear. I'd hate to accelerate right through their fence. That old man's pretty nice. I guess I shouldn't say anything. But. That dog is mean to think this, but that dog... After he gets done with barking like that, he's like panting like he can't catch his breath. He's like, <sighs> so it's probably about tuckered him out over there now, barking like that. See, he just walks right back in like, oh, I own this place. This is my house and I'm the king. I guess he does own it. He's got a little dog door. He just comes out whenever, but screw that dog. I'm tired of talking about that dog. Anyway, it's hot in here. It's been fun hanging out with you. It's been kind of a long video, hasn't it? So, okay. Well, about dark 30, and I'm gonna go in and get a shower. Go here. Go inside. So, we will talk to you soon. So, stay tuned. Thanks again for watching. As always, rate, comment, subscribe. There's no complaints. I don't want to hear any complaints. I'm just kidding. You can play. See you guys. Bye.